here's page seven. Okay. So one of the things that you do in the bathroom is wash. The general sign for wash is just, here's your hand, you have an A hand shape, and you are going in a circular motion. Wash. Lema, wash, do you have it? Okay, wash. Okay. Now, so you can say, oh, I'm going to wash the dishes, oh, I'm going to wash some laundry, I'm going to wash the windows. Okay. That's just the general sign. However, I just said wash the windows. A lot of people would sign windows, and then they would sign wash like they're washing the windows. In the bathroom, when you, we wash our bodies, we wash our face, we take our A's, and we wash our face. Sometimes you can wash your face like this too. If you're telling your child, wash your arms, then you would sign wash your arms. Wash your hands is like this, wash your hands. Wash your legs. Wash your hair. Wash, wash. So this is the sign for wash. You just put it wherever on your body you want them to wash. You can sign this way. When you're washing your face, you can sign it this way. But for all the other washes, you, you use your, your A hand shape. And the reason they do that is because when you wash your face, you're often washing like this. You know, we don't, I don't, <laughs> you know, we wash like this, so. <laughs> but the rest of our body, we tend to scrub. <laughs> the next sign is mirror. So we're looking in the mirror, and so here's the mirror, and you're kind of reflecting. So it's a little bit like this, mirror, mirror. It has to be a very small movement because there's another sign like seams. It seems. That doesn't seem right. Seams. Mirror. Do you see how close they are? You know? He doesn't seem to like playing with blocks. Seam, mirror. 